Hi, I'm Doug, your tech support representative here at Atlantic British. In this video, we're going to talk about the New Island Diagnostic Tool. Now, this is a tool that's going to be exclusive to Atlantic British. It utilizes Bluetooth, so that you're just going to be using your iPhone or your Android system phone or even your iPad, iOS iPad, with a dongle that simply plugs into the diagnostic connector in your vehicle. So it's small, it's portable, it has a tremendous amount of capabilities on it. Uh, just to give you an idea, the system coverage is more than six pages. The special functions, there are over a thousand special functions when you combine all the Land Rover vehicles. And the fact that it's on this little dongle means you can throw this in the glove box of your vehicle and should you be on the road and have a problem, you always have your diagnostic tool with you because you'll always have your cell phone in your pocket. So it's, it's a fantastic idea. So what we've done is we've put together uh, two packages where you could either purchase an individual Land Rover vehicle to run on your system, or you can go the pro version if you're a shop or you work on a lot of Land Rovers, that you will encompass the whole range of Land Rovers so that you always have whatever you need on the unit. So what we're gonna do now, just if you'd like, you wanna follow uh, the video, we have a little rundown on some of the special functions that we thought would be of special interest to a lot of Land Rover owners. The Island app comes packed with over 1,000 special diagnostic and programming functions for Land Rover vehicles. Popular special functions include air suspension height calibration, tire pressure sensor replacement, oil service counter reset, service interval reset, engine adaption reset, Transmission Adaption Reset Key Programming Recover Programmed Keys Verify Keys Security Key Fob Remote Functionality Parking Brake Setting and Unjamming Procedures GEMS Closed Throttle Position Reset Height Recalibration Auxiliary Heater Control Module. Find out more. Check out the complete list of systems coverage and thousands of special functions by vehicle model and year at roverparts.com forward slash island. And if you want to see the full range of features that the iLand has, you can go to roverparts.com and search for iLand. And then it will give you access and you can actually even download and print all the system coverage and applications to the vehicles as well as all the special functions. Okay, so stay with me and we're going to show you how easy it is to set up your new iLand diagnostic tool. Alright, so we're going to show you how to set up your new iLand on an Android system. And essentially what will happen is when you get your Android tool, you're also going to get a setup sheet similar to this that's going to basically take you right through this is an easy quick start guide and uh, what we'll start with is you're gonna turn your phone on and get on the screen now where you would go is you go to your Play Store your Google Play Store on your Android system and then this will essentially put you there and you will it'll it'll have a search on top and you just put in iLand diagnostics and it'll put you on this window and we've already installed but normally this would this box on the left is going to tell you install you hit that let it do its thing and then essentially we'll go back and you will look for your icon right on your right on your screen so we'll hit that and we'll go back on that and it's going to put you on the screen here in fact let's back this up one it's going to give you a screen that's going to essentially look like you're going to log in, but you haven't developed your your um, registration yet. So down here, just below the login box, you'll see sign up. We'll hit that. And then what it does now is it'll put you on a screen. You're going to enter in your email address. This is the address that will be designated for this phone. So once you enter it, it becomes basically a permanent address. So we're going to do that, and then we're going to go to the next screen. So you've entered your email address. The next screen you get is going to be verification. It's going to ask you to enter your received verification number, which is right here. And we'll just punch that in. Okay. 
And then we're also going to set a password in here. And it states just 6 to 20 characters. Uh, doesn't say anything else about capitals or letters or numbers or whatnot. So just 6 to 20 characters would be enough for an adequate password. So now you've entered that. You're going to hit done. So the next screen now for to complete the info. This is a registers this under your name. So you're going to enter your first name, last name, and zip code where you live. So after entering your name and your zip code and you hit done, it's going to put you on a screen that essentially at one point is going to tell you to pick a vehicle. But before it does, if there's any downloads or upgrades available on this particular via on this particular setup, it will automatically set you up. And sure enough, here we are, and we've actually have a download available. So we're going to hit download, let it do the upgrade, and then we can get into picking our vehicles. Now, in case when you do finish your registration and whatnot, and there isn't a download or an upgrade available on that at the time, you'll get this window. It'll just simply tell you sign up succeeded, and it'll tell you to activate your welcome to activate your dongle, and you will have more functions. So it's going to state it box. I'm going to hit that. Now it's going to ask for the serial number. And the activation code, which you'll receive in the dongle box with when you get your new island. And this will come with your island diagnostic tool. And there'll be a product serial number. And then on this side, the private and confidential, which will be the verification number. You'll need to open up and underneath will be the verification number. And that's what this is asking for now. So we'll type in those two numbers. All right, so at this point now, you're gonna get the screen that allows you to choose your vehicle. Being this unit is already set up for a pro, it's already set up for all the Land Rover vehicles. If you purchased your iLand for a single vehicle, of course now you choose your, your vehicle now, say either Range Rover, Discovery, whatever your vehicle is. Once you choose that, it's locked in and you cannot change that. That remains constant on the vehicle and that's all you're gonna have. So at this point now, you've you're, um, downloaded the app, you have the app, you have the vehicle choice. Now we're going to back up to Bluetooth and link you up with the dongle. So when you get on your Bluetooth screen, you're going to go, first you're going to go to settings, you go to Bluetooth. You're going to look for available devices, you'll hit that, and what it'll do is a search. And then it'll pop up the serial number on your dongle, and then at that point just tap that and it will pair it up. Now that we're paired, we have our app look, we have our app done. We can go back to our main screen. We see our iLand. And again, I'm going to spell it out. It's I-L-A-N-D. There's no S in there. You we'll go hit on the app, and basically we can now hook up into any vehicle. The first time you go into your vehicle, it's going to give you what they call workshop warnings. And these are basically just safety items that they want you to be aware of. And you'll hit accept. And then warning using battery charger and whatnot is you just read through that. These are certain little guidelines. We'll hit accept. Please wait. And now everything is just going to load up. And there you are. Now it'll even show you if there's another version available. It'll do automatic updates. So it's already loaded the newest update so we can trash can the old one. We'll confirm and take that out. So now we're on the latest and greatest. And you'll find that there'll be updates as you use this constantly they're always looking to improve the tool so we'll hit confirm and now it's going to set up the updates and get it all up to once the updates are loaded you'll be able to get on the vehicle and be able to start your diagnostics and that's basically all there is to it so if you want more information on the iLand, you can click on this link, which will take you to our website. Or if you like our online videos and want more information on those, or just simply want to view the videos, you can go to this link and then subscribe to our YouTube channel.